What is the problem for Devon's dairy farmers? Well, it isn't Devon's dairy farmers, it's all the dairy farmers. We're just losing two dairy farmers every day of the week. And uh, also, of course, we've lost a huge number of cows in this country over the last 10 or 12 years. In fact, we lost a million cattle altogether. So what have we got to do to put it right? There's only one thing to put it right, and that is to get a grip of, of this dreadful bovine TV on. But what about the returns to dairy farmers specifically? Well, the returns to dairy farmers are, are, are miserable, and they're partly miserable due to the TB, and they're also partly miserable to the returns they're getting for a pint of milk. In fact, it costs a farmer probably le he gets less for a pint of milk than he actually has to pay for a pint of water. And this is a, a fault within the food chain? This is a huge fault within the food chain and somebody in the government has to do something about it. If the, if the supermarkets themselves, if the food retailers and processors won't regulate uh, the, the situation right now, we won't get any more young farmers coming into the industry and we need 60,000 young farmers within the next 10 years. Sir, thank you very much. Have a good right. trip. Good girl. Very good. Why are the dairy farmers complaining here at the show today? We're having difficulty in getting a fair price from the marketplace, basically. Um, the retailers are uh, taking quite a good margin, the processors are taking a good margin, uh, and the farmers are coming uh, well below the cost of production. But surely, like anyone else in business, you set the price and you tell them that's what they've got to pay. <coughs> that's not quite how it is for the dairy industry. Why not? We are very weak sellers, uh, and we, are, uh, we suffer from the power of the supermarkets and the processors, uh, and uh, we're at their mercy for the prices that they will give us, virtually. Uh, and the power is needs to be re-addressed. The NFU is on process to do that. We are supporting the motion that's come through Europe to try and get better uh, uh, contracts and things, uh, but we need to keep the job on and raise a profile to continue that. We are having trouble persuading our government to come on side, which it seems to be essential that they do. And, and even more so because there's no ministers at the Devon County show today. Well, we are deeply vexed that they aren't. Oh, there's one or two questions I would like to put to uh, one or two of the key ministers. We had Mr Pace here last year, uh, and I'd like to pin him down on one or two things, uh, and the TV would be one. So basically, at the moment, the contracts you have aren't worth the paper they're written on? Yes. Thank you.